This demo will show you how to export a single Power BI report to a local folder on my laptop in PDF format. And I'm going to run this report weekly. To begin, I'm going to select single for Power BI. I'm going to choose the Power BI account that I want to use. And the report that I'm going to run, in this case, it's going to be a sales report. And click next. This is the scheduling tab and I want it to run weekly and I want it to run every week on a Monday. So I'm going to uncheck the other options. I want it to run at 7 a.m. So I'm going to simply overtype what is here and change that to be a.m. And that's all the changes I need to make. But for more information on other options available, please view the scheduling demo. I'm going to click next to save my information. This is the report settings tab. If you wish to make any changes to the report or the PDF output, then you can make that here. You simply highlight and make the change. I'm going to accept all the defaults, so I will click next. This is my report filters tab. And my report has a filter of a sales executive, so I'm going to enter that here. Click Add to add a report filter. And here we enter the table name and then the column. And this information is case sensitive. The field data type is string, so I will leave that as it is. And then I'm going to enter the sales executive name that I want to run the report for and click add. And you'll see here that my report has filter has been saved. I click next. This is the refresh data sets tab. And if you want to refresh the data set before running the report, you would set that up here. I don't, so I'm just going to click next for now. This is the destinations tab and I'm going to add a destination and it's a disk and I'm going to send it to my PBRS reports folder down there. The format I want to use is PDF and I'm going to enable PDF options. I'm going to put in an owner password and I will put in a user password. and click OK to save that information. Click Next. This is the exception handling. For more information on exception and handling, please view the exception handling demo. Click Next. This is our custom tasks section. For more information on custom tasks, please view the custom task demo. I will click Finish to save the schedule. The schedule has now been saved and I'm going to execute this manually so that you can see the resulting PDF. So I'll right click and select execute. This will take a few moments. The report has now executed successfully. So let's go and review the folder. And here is my report. I'm going to double click it to open it. And I'm being prompted for a password. And here we have the sales report for Milan Krona, which was my report filter. 
and the report is a PDF format. Christian Stevens Software. Bigger data, better business.